What's the matter, Sydney? You look like you've seen a ghost. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Father Death. I am so sorry for the month-long break. Uh, I've been working on my Scream fan film and doing some other Scream-related things, so that's why there have been no uploads. Uh, so I'm sorry I didn't post any updates or anything. Uh, I've just been really busy lately. But I'm back, and today is a good day to return because we got some big Scream news. As you probably know already, Nev Campbell is not returning for Scream 6. Uh... I am actually devastated by that news. I'm actually, I'm really upset. I'm sad. Uh, I was really hoping this wouldn't happen, but unfortunately, it's happened. Uh, she says, and I quote, Sadly, I won't be making the next Scream film. And then later, uh, she felt that, quote, The offer that was presented to me did not equate to the value I have brought to the franchise. And that, to me, is a very good reason for on Nev's part. Like, respect Nev Campbell, 100%. Um, I've seen other people saying this, too. Uh, she respects her work. She respects the character of Sidney Prescott, the Scream franchise. And she didn't feel like she was being treated fairly. And you gotta respect that in, on an actor standpoint, on, like, a job standpoint. She has some self-respect. Uh, now, in terms of, uh, you know, like, we don't know what the offer was to her. We, we don't know any of that. But the Scream franchise has grossed uh, pretty close to, uh, around $700 million uh, of, of all the movies. So, and she's been in all the movies. She makes, especially one through four, she makes those films. And <laughs> forgive me, the big reason why four was such a flop, and I know a lot of you like four, and, you know, no shade is just my opinion. The reason why Four was was a flop was because Sydney was just kind of downsided in that. She wasn't in it that much. Uh, the part she was in it, it did not matter. But this is not a Scream 4 rant. So, you know, th they got her to come back for Scream 5. She liked the script enough. She, she approved it. She was in. But now Scream 6, just they didn't offer her enough. And she further added, and I quote, it's been a very difficult decision to move on to all my Scream fans. I love you. You've always been so incredibly supportive to me. I'm forever grateful to you and to what this franchise has given me over the past 25 years. End quote. Uh, it is. Uh, so does that mean, you know, uh, is she never coming back? I don't think that's what that means. I think there is a possibility she could come back for Scream 7 or however long this franchise lasts. We're guaranteed a trilogy. We're getting a trilogy. We got Scream 5. We're getting Scream 6 coming in about a year. And then we'll get Scream 7. Maybe she'll come back for Scream 7. We don't know. I still have hope for that. Like when I first read this, I was like, you know what? She's be she's she's being respectful. She's not angry. You know, she, like they didn't scare her off. They didn't anger her off. She still has she, love for this franchise. And rightfully so because this shaped her career. You know, Nev Campbell is known for her role as Sidney Prescott. Uh... So, I don't think it's the end for her. I think she might come back. I really hope she does. And as far as the script, they what are they going to do for the script? Uh, I haven't seen any news on that yet because it's written already. Filming began today. I'm assuming they wrote the script with the a thought in mind that Sydney was returning for this movie. So, I, I don't know. Maybe they didn't write that. I, apparently, they didn't. Or they're going to make some revisions. I don't know. But that kind of scares me too, because you know, if say Sydney had an important role, then uh, you know she's not in it. They're gonna have to ch change it up a bit. But perhaps the biggest question on people's minds is, can we have Scream without Nev Campbell, without Sydney Prescott? You know, can we have Scream without her? I don't think we can, to the fullest. We can have Ghostface without her, but Scream, I really don't think we can because the whole thing at like this all started like like in in this universe in the scream universe uh with sydney's mother maureen prescott the name prescott sydney prescott it's synonymous with this uh, with this movie with this franchise so like i i don't know i don't believe we can have scream without her so overall yes i'm excited for the new movies uh we're gonna have scream we're gonna have Ghostface, but it's gonna be missing something it really is and don't get me wrong i love the new cast absolutely love jenna ortega she's the one of the best things that's ever happened to this franchise i'm excited to see what melissa barrera does with sam uh 
you know, like we do, we do, we got, we got a good cast. I'm excited to see where the story goes. I do. I like the story. I originally hated it. I've said it so many times, but it's, it grew on me. So eventually without no Sydney, it'll, it'll grow on me. Uh, so I am, I'm excited for the new movies. Uh, I do not believe it's the end for Sydney. I really don't believe it is. And I almost forgot to mention too, uh, I hope they don't just, you know, say like during the movie, like, oh, uh, Sydney is, you know, up with her kids right now or whatever like i hope they don't just i mean they're gonna have to though like I, there's not much else you can do just kind of mention her are like are they even gonna mention her are they just gonna you know make a move on without her because that to me is just extremely dishonorable you know like i i don't feel like they do that i feel like they're gonna honor her some way and you know and maybe with uh uh you know a mention of her name but like that's what i'm thinking too it's like what are they gonna do just be like have sam be like oh yeah sydney's uh gone you know it's like and you know yeah there is there's gonna be no more hello sydney what's your favorite scary movie we're not gonna have that anymore a big piece of scream has died today and the biggest argument and support for this move too is uh sydney's story is over people say you know there's no more story to tell her you know character arc is finished and I, I do partially agree with that like it would it, it is kind of she doesn't have that much story to tell but you know i'd point you to jamie lee curtis for the halloween franchise would the halloween franchise have been the same without jamie lee curtis would it have worked out no because look at what happened when they didn't get jamie lee curtis for halloween 4 which ha halloween 4 was okay debatable halloween 5 trash forgive me <laughs> halloween 6 trash uh you know like and so on and so forth until they brought it back 2018 jamie lee curtis is back boom there you go uh so you know even if her character doesn't have much to say it's still fun to have her there it's her franchise you know and i think that there is a little more story to tell for her uh especially uh, i got you guys especially if Stu comes back like i just thought about that yeah wait I am on the stew train. This changes the stew. This changes stew's return now because. Sorry, I'm just having a mind opening moment while I'm filming this. Like, I wasn't planning on even mentioning this. I, I've been away from, you know, like Scream 6 news for a while. I've been focused on other things. Yeah, Stu. Uh, I don't know what's gonna what's gonna happen with Stu now because i was really hoping he would return i'm almost guaranteeing he'll return without sydney there that's not gonna be the same like that that's not gonna be the same because you know it's like i've always had a thing for you sid like it's oh wow yeah that's not gonna be the same now i didn't think about that and i, I wanted Stu to come back and scream seven anyway i don't want him to be in scream six so there you go there's still hope because i said sydney i think is gonna be here for scream seven i think Stu's coming back for scream seven boom still there's still hope we can get Stu and sydney back because yeah without sydney Stu's return it would still be a awesome obviously but like it would it would be missing something like i said before so yeah there's everything uh, i'm gonna make more videos on it uh i got more videos coming up too for you know kirby's return you know uh i'm gonna make a whole video about Stu and sydney you know like how that's gonna pan out uh a lot more content to go and a long way to get there still again like filming just started today but yeah i'm 